Great Ormond Street is a specialist children's hospital and we tend to take referrals from other hospitals for the specialist treatment that we have available here. Lenny comes in for treatment every three months for three days. He's got a condition called osteogenesis imperfecta, which is a form of brittle bones. The key to delivering care, particularly in a complex environment like Great Ormond Street, is being able to put the information required to make decisions in the hands of our clinicians at the earliest opportunity. When we just had paper charts for observations and just day-to-day -day care plans for the patients, we did come across a lot of challenges. Over the last three years, we have deployed Apple technology. We have some 1,137 Apple devices at the moment in use across the trust. They are robust, they're easy to use, they stand up to, you know, to being used in a complex ward environment. The advantage of the Apple devices is that most of our staff are familiar with these from their home life. The iOS is compliant with all of the government standards on security out of the box and is approved for use in healthcare by the Health and Social Care Information Centre. All the data that is held on the device is encrypted. One of the systems that we've got in use at the moment is called Nerve Centre, which is a app which runs on handheld devices like the iPad or iPod Touches and that's a system that allows nursing staff to input patient observations and then behind the scenes that's integrated to produce what's called an early warning score so that interventions can be made either the medical staff on the ward or indeed across the hospital automatically receive alerts there was a particular time when I was caring for a patient a couple of weeks ago where the child deteriorated quite quickly we were short-staffed on the ward, so I was doing the observation with the iPad and within two minutes the doctor and everyone was on the ward and the patient got a lot more care. My main concern is Lenny getting the best care and anything that they do that can advance that, then obviously that's absolutely fantastic. There are some other applications. One of them is called Evolve, which is a system for accessing all of the medical reports for a patient in a single place. And then in addition to that is a system to allow nursing staff to put tasks on there that they need the doctors to do, either to change medications, to review a blood result, or something else which needs doing. Even when I don't have a native app, I can touch on the screen and access everything on my computer here, including all of the hospital systems. Over the last three years, the number of mobile devices the Great Ormond Street has deployed has risen very rapidly. And key to that has been a strong relationship with a supplier called XMA in terms of getting those devices in. We use a public sector procurement framework in terms of helping us maximise the return on investment. XMA have added value to the delivery of the iOS devices that we have. Things like covers, so we have the infection control arrangements already in place. Since we've been using these, we definitely wouldn't want to go back to paper charts. They're just so much easier to have with us. It really does help with the children. The most important thing is that Lenny's happy and that he's comfortable and he's not in any pain. I think it's really exciting the fact that we've now begun to roll out Apple devices in the trust. Hopefully as we implement more and more of this technology, we'll spend less time searching for information and more time either interpreting that information or acting on it or spending time with the patients.